All right, so the next thing about your jab is you might not just throw one jab, you might throw two jabs or even three. So we're gonna focus on that spring loading action of the left arm. So a lot of times, sometimes people throw like power jabs. So, you know, there might be a time and place for that, but we think about the jab as trying to set up for the power right. So when I throw my jab in slow motion, right, I still do my step in, but if I'm gonna throw two of them, I might go boom, boom. I might not retract all the way, although a full retraction is nice if you can be really spring-loaded in your shoulder and your tricep. So you hear like this, boom, boom, like that, okay? So it's like boom, boom. So it causes the opponent to kind of think like a rapid fire. So you might go and throw your right hand in afterwards, all right? So again, thinking about your jab, just going, right? One, two, or one, two. The quicker you make it, the tougher it becomes to fully retract it each time. I even sometimes feel like I have trouble getting that coordination down. But if you get that coordination down really good, just keeping the hand up. You notice my front foot kind of steps with it sometimes. Okay, so your front foot acts as kind of like a, a steering wheel, I guess where your toes are pointed, that's where you're gonna go. So if you start pointing your toes in different areas and your right leg becomes the driver of the power, which translates up through the body. So, and sets up for right crosses or sometimes even a hook.